Praise be to God. Daily One Missionary. Today's Missionary John Wesley. Birth 17-6-1703. Death 02-03-1791. Native Place. Link and Share England. Place of Vision England. John Wesley was an Anglican clergyman and an evangelist. With his brother Charles, he was the co-founder of the Methodist movement in the Church of England. Born into a religious family, Wesley was molded through a strict code of Christian morality. After graduating from the Christ Church, Oxford was ordained a deacon in the Church of England in 1725. While at Oxford, he was an active member of the Holy Club and enthusiastically participated in prayers, Bible studies and prison ministry. He was ordained a priest in 1728 and started ministering in northern Lincolnshire on the request of James Ogletorpe. Wesley set sail to the New World, a newly founded colony of Georgia, in 1735 with the zeal to bring the gospel to them. Though his mission work was brief and was disappointing for him, he was deeply influenced by the German Moravian missionaries he met during the stay there. The spiritual confidence and commitment to practical deity impressed him deeply. After returning to England, Wesley experienced a spiritual conversion while listening to a reading of Martin Luther's preface to the Epistle of the Romans. With a renewed spirit, Wesley started preaching about salvation through faith in Christ alone. He began an itinerant ministry that lasted more than 50 years. His readiness to preach even outside the church saw the gospel being preached to the neglected masses about whom the Church of England had little concern. A powerful revival set England on spiritual fire and resulted in thousands accepting Christ. The reluctance of the church to accept his biblical principles forced him to form private societies who gathered methodically every week for Bible studies and prayers, hence were called Methodists by the critics. Wesley went about establishing Methodist society throughout the country despite the opposition and persecution which he had to endure. He continued throughout his life a regimen of personal discipline and ordered living till he finished his race in 1791. Beloved, how ordered and disciplined is your life? Lord, enable me to live a disciplined life and remain active in your ministry until my last breath.